motorbike ilikuwa inatupea escort juli kuji kanifuata juli ko peke yangu au wengine wako na gari so waka not kuna mtu mmoja ameba amebaki wakarudi so mimi niko monitors tunaenda tu tunaenda tu kufika hapo mbele kapatana na monkeys zile monkeys iko so aggressive <laughs> so ziliona like nilikuwa na chupa unajua unakunywa maji jua ni kali unatoa uh, like food kwa na like mfuko kwa jazis so unakula so i think ziliona hiyo last other size of speed ilikuwa imepungua juu saki kwenda eh, saki pia kwenda sana eh, wale wengine na wangoja sasa manki wa zilikuja venye zilikuja aki wa <laughs> venye ni help ni pikipiki likawa mapema so hao ndo walikuja nikawa na zigonga zikahepa those zinge ni zinge ni attack vibaya sana so wakanisaidia kama maneuver hiyo place kaenda mbele tena nikaenda mi yeah. niliziona zime unajua huwa zinaka hivi kwa barabara kama tu mtu tu unatuona ndo tu mimi kajua hizi ni monkeys hizi hazina shida hata siendi haraka kwanza ungekuwa na wale watu wanapenda picha wangesimama anze ku eh yeah. <laughs> sasa mimi nakuja tu hey, naona zina nikaona moja imesimama sasa imesimama na miguu hizi mami sasa vinaka hivi inaniangalia imevuka barabara imefuka like half, half way ya barabara eh kuangalia zingine tatu na zile kubwa unajua za pale zinakoga kubwa nikasema hizi ni zinataka so by the time niende kunifikia hapa like zinanirukia pikipiki ndio ikafika ikazi ikazifukuza pikipiki unajua ilizifukuza kimeenda mbele so akaniacha nyuma kidogo kuniacha tena ndo hizo <laughs> wewe we. Na ni kusprint nikaona hapa na nimechoka na nikaka mlima na, na kuna headwind nilichukue mawe kulikuwa na mawe wetu wengi huku kando nikazirushia zikahepa ah yo sorry kaisha hapo nikaendelea wakarudi jua na jua kuna wengine nyuma na hizo vitu zinazofanya the same thing so nikaenda mbele sasa kufika mbele naona elephant <laughs> so uzuri iko ime, ime cross iko like kwa pa kuna iona tu kwa pa kuna jua voi hiyo national park inakuwa like haina uh, fence so unaona wanyama tu eh wakivuka so mimi naona ndo zile elephant sasa hapo ndo ilibidi i think hapo ndo nili keep time vizuri <laughs> juni nilipigie sabu iki kitu kiniona kiniona nikiwa hapa na iko pale before ipige kukimbia ifike hapa kuna kenye naweza fanya hapa ni ipi ipi sasa mimi naona tu ndo venye zinafanya zafanya ilibidi nime attack so nileka speed yangu yote kufika huko mbele niliisha kabisa hata watu wenye walinifikia walikuwa wanajua huyu ameisha <laughs> it is not easy the journey is tough but there is a goal as sam tells me the driving force burning in his chest the initiative was just to fight for for this small community because uh, if you go to hospitals there is a provision for people with uh, HIV there is provision for people with cancer but there is nothing for sickle cell it's treated like an other disease it is not understood it's not well understood yeah so we we thought that if we could come together as cyclists and uh, push the agenda through at least we, if we could get at least four machines that can identify sickle cell anemia and help treat in the country it will make a big difference uh, it's uh, sickle cell anemia is actually it's sickle cell disease it's actually the def- deformation of the red blood cells that carry oxygen through the blood so these cells are kind of look they are incomplete the red blood cell looks like a donut you know what a donut looks like now cut just like a, a small piece of it it now looks like a sickle yeah the tool used for for pruning for pruning uh, bushes that's how they look like so unfortunately these cells these sickle cell shaped cells they die easily so the person who suffers from sickle cell disease feels uh, heavy when they are breathing because they now have very little oxygen i mean very little red blood cells to transport oxygen through the body yeah and uh, sadly it's uh, hereditary the disease it's a common disease uh, it's uh, 
passed from generation to generation. Mm. Yeah, you may find that your father may have it. The greatest gift any human being can ever have is great health. That's something my mom always told me when I was a kid. She always kept saying it when I was a teenager. She always kept saying it when I was a young man. And she still keeps, keeps on saying it. The greatest health, the greatest wealth is health. And she always told me how lucky I am that I never felt sick. The ride, I could at least do it to enjoy the reason behind it. Na ile reason kubwa ilikuwa ni kuchangisha pesa. At least kuna history za siko sela what awareness ijulikane because kuna wasi wengi wanaishi bi wanaishi nayo na wajui. Yeah. So at least hizo pesa zikipatikana wataweza kutibiwa hivyo na wasaidike. So hiyo ndio kitu ilikuwa hiyo ndio ilikuwa motivation sana. Hiyo ndio kitu ilikuwa inatusukuma. Since nianze cycling sijawafanya kitu kama hiyo. <laughs> yes tunafanya kilometers mingi. 250, 300 lakini si 500 that you non stop. Mm -mm. Kasema so kama kuna mtoto uh, anaumia na anavumilia ugonjwa, kwa nini mimi nisivumilie kwa kumsaidia kwa ku ride, ku create awareness, watu wa donate apate hiyo machine na wajulikane wako venye watatritiwa. The joy of a journey well accomplished, clearly written all over their faces. A joy and a satisfaction that no money can buy. <laughs> we started with uh, social media, created posters, and uh, we started just uh, pushing the agenda, uh, two, three days, make a post about uh, sickle cells. And uh, we wrote proposals to certain other organizations. Uh, we actually made a gamble with Safaricom, because uh, we didn't know, we just, we just risked. And uh, we were shocked, they said they'll pledge for us uh, 250,000, yeah, which is, which is good money. <laughs> it is indeed. We've done also other many other pledges. I mean, we've gotten many other pledges, but uh, hopefully they'll come through. And uh, we also use the pay bill number for Scarf Kenya. It's an, an organization that uh, deals with the fight for the health and treatment for sickle cell in Kenya. Yeah, so using their pay bill number. We pu pushed it as well, advertised as much as we could, and uh, we also reached out to our cycling community, uh, Kenya Cycling, uh, to get as many as many numbers and well wishes to, to donate. Morris Nyakundi, a professional skater, tells us why this mission is of value to him and why people should join in the sport. When you have a cycle challenge, you know, I post your timeline. Time time yeah, Facebook, and then there's my friend who will my post. So like, I have this kilometer ni 500, and me na have 300. I have 300 most ni me end, I have my choker, I have my isha. So I have more. More is 500, you are trist. Make a difference, that is Strava. I have a friend who has to me Strava. I have a trist system of 500 kilometers. I have 300, 200, 150, I have Acha say leo isome, so liona me post, so nika wanapo kuna namba, nika call Asha, this is Kupida, anaitua Asha. Afa kana mba, this hakuna shida, let me jo, join. Nika join, lakini likuwa na uoga, kupiga 500 <laughs> in, one, in one day, that's when four hours, yeah. Likuwa trip, hali likaribu ni quit, nika wana like, jay pige yo, in one day, ayy. Kasama, ah, jutuko wengi, na kuna wasi wakona MTB, ah, acha tu. The people wanna think we have money because we did that awareness. Hmm? We zia chakitu na pena ni passion eh. Ni kasi koko adamu. And then ni uki cycle cycle ni za family. Kwa tayi vena cycle ni siku anje za family. Una goti ana. But this jona sport ni wasewa ko friendly. In cycle ni bedo kuwadi cycle ni. 
ukiwa hadi saiko kwa njia mtu anakukotea unadu unaweza kana watu kwa njia hivyo tu Bernard Lihanda invites all well wishes to participate and support this noble mission Tungependa kushukuru sana kwa wale wenye ali to support wale wenye alitusaidia sana kwa hiyo ride hiyo ride ilikuwa ilikuwa ride ya maana sana to the society so ile kitu tungependa ni usaidizi wenu pia cuz baada hatujafika mwisho siko seli jaisha ni kitu ina inaenda inaenda generation after generation so bado tunachangisha do na the pay bill ya pesa pay bill ni 95 40 and account number siko seli yeah Alafu for more information you can check out on Facebook at Sikosel ah uh, what not Sikosel Scarf Kenya Instagram Scarf Kenya YouTube Scarf Kenya TV LinkedIn Scarf Kenya yeah